Something feels odd here. Be on your guard. I just noticed none of you other Danans have spirit cores. Why is that? Both of my parents were part of the resistance in Calaglia. In fact, my birth was kept a secret from the Renans. Mine too. We always lived in hiding, so I never had a spirit core embedded in me like I was supposed to. What about you, Alfin? You were a slave in Calaglia before all this, weren't you? To be completely honest, I'm not sure why I don't have one. All the other Danon slaves around me did. I was the only exception. They tended to keep their distance from me to avoid attracting any attention from the soldiers, because of my mask and all. What about you, Kisara? Do you still have your spirit core? No. I was able to find a good Renin doctor who's sympathetic to our kind, and had them remove it before I left. They did such a great job, the procedure didn't even leave a scar. One of the benefits of coexistence, huh? I know that once the spirit vessel was shut down, there wasn't much need for me to hurry. But still, I didn't like having that mark of servitude lingering on me any longer than I had to. It may sound a little strange to hear me say this, but... I'm just me now. Not a guardsman or a slave. I'm my own woman. And this is my chance to have a new beginning. This sure is one rugged road. You'd think they'd keep this at least a little better maintained, right? Why spend energy fixing that which is rarely used? Repairs require time and effort, which in our world means slaves, often in great numbers. Ah. For you, it may be a simple request, but that can quickly become another's difficult burden. Nobody gains anything without someone expending effort. And you know, somehow that someone always ends up being a Danon, while the Renans are the ones who gain. True enough. Ideally, in a perfect world, I think it's only fair that the ones who need it should be the ones to perform the work. However, when doing so could be dangerous like it is here, there are many who would prefer that it be others who risk their lives in their stead. So, what you're saying is that people will just put up with the inconvenience until someone else comes along to fix it for them? Indeed. And it is those who can no longer bear that feeling that inevitably take action. Much like the Danans in our group do so now. As strange as it may be to hear such a thing from the likes of myself. It's true that most of the Danans in Calaglia have been resigned to just accepting things as they are. Still, we can't just blame them for... <sighs> what are you making that face for? You're not worn out already, are you? <sighs> nah. Just regretting I ever said anything in the first place. There's no 
nowhere to run from my heart. When he slows down, that's our chance. Leave the agile one to me. I'm on it. Raging Here I come. Swallow blade. Corruption. Take this. Double demon fight. Let's tear him up. Get out of this! Rising 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 this one's got your name on it! Action to action! A melee destruction! There's still more to go! Got some interesting moves there, Dohalim. I'm glad you're on our side. I'm simply glad to hear that I can make myself useful to you all. Huh? What's wrong? We seem to have come across some rather unusual objects. What, you mean that pile of garbage? No mere garbage, I assure you. Still, I've never seen anything shaped like it before. I'm intrigued. Uh, uh... Are you curious about this stuff, Rinwell? Uh, oh. Uh, yeah. I think he might have found some old Danon relics. They look like the remains of a bunch of objects that disappeared after the Renans first invaded. And yet here I am, holding them without so much as a second thought. I imagine this sight must be unsettling to you. Not really. Just that it must be nice to be a Renin who has time to indulge in stuff like that. Unlike the rest of us. Are you interested in this stuff too, Dohalim? Charmed may be a better turn of phrase. I simply love objects that can give me a sense of what their maker was thinking. The history that went into their creation. You see, we Renans have hardly any such objects that trace back to our distant past. I still don't understand what you two find so intriguing about it, though. Why not? We're talking about our own culture here. I get that, but it's not like this stuff is any use now, does it? It's just old. Real old. Oh, but it does. Holding it in your hands like this, one can feel and engage with the distant past in a way no history book can ever accomplish. Oh. Take your word for it. Well, seeing as it's Dan in history, just make sure you're careful with it. All right, Dohalim? But of course. There's history in the air here. I can smell it. I don't... Smelling. Anything? Don't encourage him. Visibility along this path will remain limited for some time. Take care not to get ambushed. I'm surprised you know the terrain here so well. 
Words don't strike me as having much time for wandering in the woods. Sometimes I would take strolls along here when I wished to be alone. You always did have a bad habit of disappearing without telling any of us guardsmen. done. are bearing fruit. It's so hilly around here. I can feel my feet getting blisters. That's mountain hiking for you. It can be pretty tough if you're not used to these sorts of trails. I take it you're comfortable with them, then? Oh, yeah. We used to run up and down these slopes all the time for our training exercises. Damn. You weren't messing around. It's on! Resonate with the Earth! I'm surrounded! Coral Blade! Negative Rising Eat this! No sooner said than done! An astral art? That's my cue! Shut him down! I'm sorry to be a father. We've all got enough on us. Yes, ma'am! You may quit work of them! You want me to pick up your slack then? Coming through! Ha! Smell! Scarlet Inferno! Rising Wyvern! Thank you! Mega Red! I'm on a roll now! Plasma Shock! Raging Luna Storm! Here goes! Crawling Storm! Only the best materials in your garments. You really do have quite the discerning eye, Dohalim. Yeah, they all kind of look the same to me. Water! 
Hear my call. Hey, when did I you get picked the wrong fight? In a vine? Hear me, flame of fury! Burning strike! Glacial fear! Rising wyvern! Now I'm in the groove! Rising falcon! Crumble! It's time! Sonic thrust! Resonate with the earth! You're mine! Still out of sight! If in the sky, it's mine! Rising wyvern! Spread! Glacial Leave the enemy's art to me! What you through! No complaints here! You're mine! Shattering the it. Take this. Double demon fang. Wow. Look what I just found. Get lost. You picked I'm the wrong up. fight! Where are you going? Talent and you can eat it! Armor won't save you! Begin! Excited. It's like trying to get up to the wall! Do it! Come on, Go now! Get toasty! Burn strike! Right, next one! Sample. Already on! Here, let me I'm go! I'm like bait to them! Azure Storm! Raging Demon Storm! Double Demon Fang! Prepare to be seen, though, coming through. Actually, Come that fight Actually, that sound is more appropriate. Less talking, more doing! Take this! Strike! And do it! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! And your storm! You picked the wrong Begin. fight! Uh, I'm at the hurricane! Seriously! If it's in the sky, it's mine! Everlasting you see, what darkness. happened there is you crossed me. Shouldn't have Dragon been like me of brawn before brain. Um, Long, you? Get toasty! Burn strike! I can feel my precision improving. This will make us even more formidable. More Dan and Ruins here. Here too, I see. What were people even thinking back then? Trying to build anything around here. M maybe they just had that much time and energy on their hands. Should make for some good weapon crafting material. I'm impressed you managed to keep up. Don't patronize me! I 
That's no... Ordinary enemy I see over there. This one will be difficult to predict. Dragon Shadow! Oh. I never miss! Win! Can you take it? Mirage! Tempest! It's turn of Tempest! Radiant here! Do it! Take this! Ritual! Demons descend! Flashing Fang! Water! Hear my blow! Be still! Right here! Hear me! I'll tear you apart! Water! Kill him! You see what happened there as you crossed me? You shouldn't have done that! I never missed! The fight! Can you take it? The tide of battle has turned! That's the power of calm rats in all! Ignite! I'm ready! This one's got your name on it! Action to action! A melee distraction. There's still more to go. I'm in your deck, Johan. Then tonight's meal is on you. Just keep going. In an instant. Impact cross. Cyan is one. Rising up. 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 Rising Ha! Am I on a roll or what? Well, look who's in a bright and shiny mood. place here? Some kind of old house? Hmm. I don't know about that. Nice one, Alfin. Yeah, there's more where that came from. Is there anything more magnificent than the musculature of a warrior? Perhaps it is in search of this perfect beauty that I myself am drawn into battle.
backing down! Huh? Eagle Company, set the ray! Now you see what I can do! Not on my watch! Dark wing! I never miss! This yeah. one's mine! All right! Cool it's again. showtime! I now. never miss! Ready, play. Fly. Sweet huh. dreams! None shall Don't do it! Your power is set In an instant! Impact block! Lightning can down! Lightning can down! No further! Seven eyes! Do it! Now. Totally! In an instant! Impact, Impact claw! Huh. There! Right! Be still! Thunder! I'm practically unstoppable! That equipment should come in handy. That big tower over there. What do you say we check back in on the ranch?
I always love the sound of hammers banging away. Want something to munch on, Hoodle? Mmm. Looks perfect and tastes just as good. Don't leave me. Care if I hang out for a while? <sighs> you worried about what's going on with Menencia? What makes you think that? Well, you were speaking to Kisara earlier, weren't you? It's rude to listen in on others, you know. Sorry. I didn't hear what you two were actually talking about, though. I just figured it was Menencia since it was the two of you. I am but a former lord who has abandoned his post. I'm no longer in a position to lead the realm in any capacity whatsoever. Yet Kisara still seeks out my opinions, knowing full well that is the case. This despite the fact I am no longer her master either. Couldn't it be precisely because you're not her master anymore? It's natural for friends to want to hear each other's opinions. <laughs> I hadn't considered that possibility. It's funny what you miss sometimes. Hardly uncommon among artistic types such as myself. When lordships are decided based solely on one's astral energy, it can lead to funny results. But even so, you still took your job as lord seriously, didn't you? Certainly. I learned to perform my functions. However, I was less interested in ruling so much as avoiding life and death decisions. Of course, such a mentality in the end led only to sickening pain and death taking place elsewhere out of sight. I pretended not to see or hear any of it, content to let our supposed peace and equality keep me blind and deaf to reality. I was a fool. But you're making amends. I would like to think so. The path ahead is dark, yet I still walk on. I merely pray that I shan't fall down any holes along the way. Do you mind watching our camp tonight? Shall we get moving?
read the landing. Still thinking about how to act around Dohalim? That obvious, huh? Except I don't think I'll be changing much after all. Don't get me wrong, I'm not going to stay his servant. However, I am going to treat him like a fellow comrade, the same way I would with you or anyone else. For as long as I can remember, I've spent my life protecting others. But isn't that what friends do too? Support and protect one another in times of need? Which in the end, pretty much means doing as you've always done, right? If that's what you're most comfortable with, I'm certainly not going to give you any grief over it. Actually, I've been thinking about how I ought to act around you all as well. Oh? When I set out on this journey, it was to rid Eldamen and Sia of its enemies, and search for wisdom in the outside world. Wisdom that I could potentially put to use on my return. I'm grateful to you all for letting me tag along. But it got me thinking. What am I actually contributing by being here? What are you talking about? You know how to hold a weapon, don't you? That's help enough. Is it, though? Sometimes I wish there was more I could be doing to pull my... Oops! Sorry about that. Jeez, I'm famished. Now that you mention it, what do you guys normally do for food and meals when you're out and about on your travels? What do you mean, what do we do? We find stuff to eat and eat it. So long as it's meat, I'm not fussy. Eating what you like can be good for morale in the short term, but you need to think about your diet if you want to stay healthy. Does that mean eating vegetables too? Isn't that obvious? It does, which I guess hasn't been happening up till now. Yeah, to be honest, we could be eating better than we do. Understood. In that case, I'll just have to make sure you're all staying healthy and eating right myself. Fortunately, I happen to know a thing or two about cooking as well. You hear that, Law? Sounds like you'll be eating your greens after all. What is it? No, oh, sorry, it's just... I was just wondering if you had any thoughts on all this. It will do her good to have a project. No, not Kisara. I meant you. Was there anything you wanted to add? Me? Certainly you're not looking to me for culinary skill, I hope. <laughs> Typical Renan. Leaving everything to someone else. Rinwell, I don't think... That said, should you need my skills on the battlefield, please rest assured I have no intention of shirking my responsibilities, regardless of who we may face. I'm sure no one doubts that. Listen, guys, if we're traveling together, we should probably at least try to make an effort to get to know one another, don't you think? I wouldn't get your expectations too high in that regard. Believe it or not, sometimes I'm not sure I even know myself all that well. Hmm... Something wrong? You look like you're deep in thought. Not exactly. I was merely thinking about you two and your sense of etiquette. Uh, oh? Etiquette? Indeed. To be quite frank, I find your lack of manners to be nigh intolerable. That's not being frank, that's being an... and... forget it! Do we really need to talk about this now? Yes. I find such impropriety on your parts to be deeply unsettling. It concerns me greatly. What do you want us to do? We were slaves. We never got to learn how to be proper like you. Yeah, what he said. Maybe you missed how we were just focused on surviving. Perhaps, but Kisara here demonstrates that it's quite possible for a Denon to learn proper manners. That's because I was given the opportunity to learn. Moreover, my duties as a guardsman required it. Not every realm is like Menencia, as you well know. Yeah, I don't think it's fair to hold us to some other city standards. Exactly! You've got to remember what it's been like for us living under the Rena elsewhere. Hmm. I will concede that you do indeed make a valid point. It would appear, for all my espousing the virtues of equality between our peoples, I was still looking down on the two of you. You don't need to beat yourself up. I wasn't that offended by what you said, man. Nevertheless, I shall mind my words from here on out. Having said that, I do believe you two would still benefit from learning the basics of proper society. I would be more than happy to teach you both when we camp out, if you like. 
Yeah, no, I'll pass. Acting all prim and proper isn't really my style. If you say so. How about you, Law? Would you like to learn? Although I suppose my first task is to reform your attitude toward the idea of good etiquette. You're not gonna let this go, are you? Stop for a minute. What's up? You already tired? My armor's pretty heavy. I think I need a little rest. I second that. All of this walking is starting to take its toll on me as well. What? You don't look it. We can't spare the time. There's places we need to be. Mahogsar's capital, Niaz, is our destination right now. But if one of us collapses, it will only serve to slow us down. And in your case, Alfin is the only one who could carry you. Best to rest while you have the opportunity. I... Enough already! I need a break, so we're taking one. <sighs> I don't need you fretting over me. Fretting? Hey, it's not like I'm... for you. For me? Why? You were looking for me. Why? Beautiful, precious life. What the? That is all I desire. Then why are we fighting? Who even are you? Bastard! This guy's not normal! His speed is unbelievable! You mean he even surpasses a lord? Armor won't down. save you! I'm ready! I'm just getting started! I never miss! Try harder! Quiver for him! Quiver for him! Quiver for him! Quiver for him!
Is that all that you've got? Very well. Then die. Wake up, please! Alfin? Shion! Thanks, but you're kind of crushing me. Oh, sorry. It's okay. And so am I. It's not as bad as it looks. Not bad? That's... Shion, we thought I'm you fine. were... I'm fine. Really. What the hell were you thinking? Well, you were trying to protect me too, you know. Yeah, but I have the sword. It's different. It's not different. Besides, I... Hmm? Never mind. It's nothing. Anyway, uh, thank you. But I didn't. <sighs> Look, I'm just glad that you're... Uh? Alfin? Sorry, I... That guy said he'd be back. I think maybe we should get moving before he returns, right? Rinwell has a good point. We need to go. Shion, are you sure you're okay? Shion, are you sure you're okay? Yeah. I already applied some healing arts to it. It didn't even leave a scar. But his sword went nearly straight through you. I'm all right. Unless I've turned into some kind of ghost and I'm haunting you all right now. No, I know you're not. It's just... Look, I appreciate you looking out for me, but I'm fine, really. There was also that strange light that appeared when Xion was stabbed. It seemed to make the enemy retreat when he saw it. Alfin, do you have any idea what it might have been? A light? I don't know. I was kind of preoccupied with other things at the time. Hmm. Now that I think of it, between that light and the blazing sword, just what sort of person are you, Alfin? Can you use Danon astral arts like Rinwell, perhaps? He wouldn't know, Dohalim. He doesn't have any memories from his past, remember? Besides, we should really be getting out of here. I suppose you're right. Forgive me. We've almost reached Nias, the capital of Mahagsar. With any luck, we'll find a place there for Xion to rest. <sighs> hey. Hmm. 
How are you holding up after that last fight? You're not too hurt, are you? I'm fine, really. See for yourself. If things get too tough out there, go ahead and fall back. I can take a beating if I need to. I'm not here just to stand around and have everyone protect me. I get that, but there's nothing wrong with admitting you have weaknesses, too. Do I look like I'm just trying to put on a brave face to you? Uh, <laughs> I can't feel pain, but you still can, can't you? <sighs> look, I appreciate you're trying to look out for me, but even you go down in fights from time to time. Please, stop trying to babysit me. It's getting old. It's not that. I just... <sighs>